Hey guys, I just wanted to review this. It's a um, titano fork, um, uh, you know, reflections token. You get uh, more tokens the more you know people buy and sell and and things like that. So yeah, let's talk about this. Uh, what I like about this is it's I think it's yeah it's it's new. It's only I don't know not a, not even a week old or it's about a week old and. You know, all these, they, they say, you know, huge fixed staking APY. That's because you're basically getting reflections every, you know, so often. This one is 30 minutes. So 48 times a day you're getting reflections off this. Um, uh, so yeah, this is, yeah, being a Titano fork, all you, all you do is buy it and hold it in your wallet and you receive those rewards off that. Now I want to say, you know, obviously the risks of these is that you know one people don't buy and sell and it's just kind of stagnant in your wallet obviously prices go down if your uh, buying pressure isn't uh, moving and the other thing is if there's a lot more sales and the price of the token goes down you know a lot of the times that price that token um, drops faster than uh, the rewards that you're getting from that token so you know, if the token drops 50% and you got 25% more in your wallet, you're you're losing money basically. So, yeah, let's talk about kind of the the features about this. Um, they were, you know, obviously audited, audited. Uh, they've got that on there. They talk about safety. They've got a multi-sig um, uh, situation where. It takes four out of five people on the team, and I think th two of those are actually like influencers, people not actually part of the project itself, um, that have to to be able to get into that treasury. Four out of those five people have to uh, basically sign on to that. Uh, the security, the treasury is locked for five years. Uh, there's no getting around that. Their the whole team is doxed which is nice to see, you know, a lot of, a lot of teams don't really do a lot of doxing, especially with, um, yeah, anyway, I don't know, as you guys can see, I'm doxed. My name's right on the channel. Um, uh, we already talked about the earnings 48 times per day and you get your rewards every 30 minutes. So, um, uh, let's see some other things. They do lots of like live M AMAs. They're, their team does those, which is great. Um, yeah, we've already talked about that big APY. I want to look at the roadmap and I want to talk about why, uh, you know, I might throw a little bit into this token because I like to see where they can go. Um, and and let me talk about the roadmap, yeah, the roadmap before we talk about the chart. You know, we've talked, we went past the pre-sale um, I wish a lot of these things didn't have like pre-sales. I wish they would just open them up and let people buy. I don't like the, you know, the whitelisting and, you know, special launches and stuff like that. Especially when, you know, people know people, things like that. I, I just don't like those. But anyway, that's another story. Um, uh, they just had an AMA. Uh, we're, kind, we're right in this one right here, the April 4th, the 10th, um, the CoinGecko listing. Uh, they're going to be on coin market cap. Uh, they're going to do some advertising. They're doing some partnership videos. And then, you know, so we're right in here. The next one on the list is they're doing um, Google ads, YouTube ads, uh, uh, BS, BC, BSC scan ad campaigns. So they're doing a lot of ad campaigns coming up uh, in the next uh, week or so. They're going to be starting those. So that's what I'm looking at, and I'm looking at that along with um, the the chart here. You can see, you know, it, it launched, it went up a little bit, came down, it jumped up again, and ever since was that about the third, the end of the well, about midday on the second, it's been kind of coming down. Now, you know, I'm not saying this is going to happen, um, but if they launch a huge ad campaign. You know this could start coming back up so you know I'm not saying this is the bottom I'm not saying this is the bottom of the dip but that's what I'm watching I'm watching for this token um, 
to come down. Uh, I would have almost bought right here with this candle here, but I would have watched the next one to see if it was going to keep going up, but it didn't. It went back down. Um, if it would have started going up again with that candle like that, with the wicks like it is, um, that would have been a good uh, buy point. So what I'm going to be looking for is that similar thing, that candle that comes up. It's got a good strong um, rise and then a following candle that's moving up. And I'll probably be looking at that on like the one hour, maybe the I'm on the four hour chart now. So that's what I'm looking for on this. Um, you know, if you looked at if you look at things like this, you know, it had a, a big sell off, but it had just a, a small buy. If these were reversed, if it was this one and then this one was on top of it, it probably would have looked good um, in the charts. But this thing is so new, it could be very unpredictable. Um, yeah. I mean, this was a good one. You could see a good strong wick here right after that sell, and then it started moving up. That would have been a good buy point. Um, yeah, sorry, just the you know the day trader, the it me that you know I've looked over these charts before. Anyway, that's kind of what I'm looking for. You know, is this the bottom of the dip? Is it going to keep going lower? You know, what's going to happen with this token? Uh, you know, is it worth buying now? I don't know. That's that's up to you to decide. You know, if you if you want to get in on this project, it looks like they're having a lot of buys recently, which is good to see. Um, so I guess we'll we'll see what happens. Uh, let's see. Another thing they're doing on they post this on Twitter. They're doing a um, contest. Basically, if you purchase a hundred dollars worth of uh, Levia. Um, uh, then you are entered to win. I don't like the whole, you know, they're giving away five B and B to the biggest buyer. I hate rewarding whales more than are, they're already getting. Um, but they're randomly selecting five people to uh, get that one B and B each. So, you know, it's a giveaway. It's decent, but I just don't like that five B, five B and B to the biggest buyer. I don't know. I'm just not a whale. I yeah. I'm sure you whales out there are great guys, but I'm not one to think that you guys should get the biggest rewards for when you buy things like that. I mean, I don't know. Anyway, that is that. It's basically Titano Fork. Uh, anyway, guys, tell me what you think in the comments below. You know, I'm always looking at these when they're at the bottom. I, I don't, I hate buying these things sometimes and watching them just plummet. Uh, but that's one that I'm just gonna be watching it's some, you know, I don't know. I like watching some of these things and seeing what they're going to do and trying to see, you know, time them correctly. You know, I don't know. I've done a lot of day trading and things like that. I did it for a few months straight where I just kind of watch charts and um, there are patterns there, but sometimes even if you follow the pattern, they could, you know, drop to like a rock afterwards. Um, Anyway, guys, uh, like the video if you like it. Hit subscribe if you want to subscribe, and we'll catch you on the next one.